Now I'm not the best printer in the world and I'm definitely not the best person to use a laptop or any computer technologies but one thing for sure is I'm, I'm certain that that is A4 paper. That is definitely A4 paper. I've even... Look, 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 look. Here we go. A4 paper. As A4 as it can get. Now, the issue I'm facing is this. So, I'll create a document on Photoshop because that's how I roll. A4, that clearly says A4. So let's create. Ah, oh, beautiful. So let's just quickly show you. I'll just do a little bit of gradient across here. There you go. File, print. And then we get this little square. So quite clearly, this area is what's going to be printed and the area here this area is going to be the white bits that are going to be showing on my print but I don't want that so let's print anyway here we go work your magic HP Also this little trusty thing with only a few quid and it works a charm. You might be wondering why I'm wasting all this colour ink to show you this but I've got plenty. Look we can see already the white bit you're probably wondering what the actual question is. Well, the question is, how do I make sure that I can fill the whole A4 paper with content? I don't want any white showing. Oh. What's happened here then? Ah. Well, it hasn't run out of ink. It's probably just deciding what's happening. Come on. You can understand what I mean though. There's like a border. But I want the colour to stretch over to this white. But on here, I'm not sure what the settings are to like try and adjust that. I mean at least it's neat, you can tell it's equal. It's like watching paint dry for you guys, I guess, isn't it? I'm sorry. Wow. There you go. Look, and even on the end here, you've got all this gap. So if you can tell me what I need to do to stop getting that, and so I can fill the whole thing with this colour and content, then please let me know. Thank you.